Hey guys, if you're like me, my Boston ferns tend to dry out a lot in the summer. Well, I have a wonderful tip from my neighbor who's been gardening 70 years. She showed me last year, and this is her tip. She has also worked with garden clubs, but she called me over last year and said, Teresa, come here. And she had these diapers. She goes, let me show you how we can make our ferns moister, and it can also help a dripping problem in your pot. So you take your, and I'll show you this, but this is an actual diaper wrapped around the roots of the tree. It goes back in your pot. Yep. Just like this, because you know, the diaper will hold the moisture in the pot and then you snap it all back together. So let's do this. I'll show you how simple this is. If you're getting a, this is a Boston fern. They like shade to part sun. It can take a little sun, but not the, the extreme heat of the sun. So when you come into your pot, you can see these little clips. It's only clipped on one side. If you push down and pull it out, it comes right off. And I like to take just two of these clips off. And then you can take your plant out of the pot. Hopefully this one comes out like the other one did. Yep, there it comes. And uh, that one's already unclipped. Okay, now I did take a little bit of soil off the bottom so that my diaper will fit. Just that little bit of pad from the diaper. I didn't want it to make it stick too much out of the pot. But I never, when it comes to my ferns, I never take them out of the pot, add any soil all year round. They just come the way they are. But this has been such a help. So you take your diaper, spread it out just like you would if you were diapering a little baby. Set your plant in the middle up against the sides, find your tabs. Oh, sorry. You find your tab and you pull this up and wrap it around. Come to the other side, adjust your plant if you need to. All we want is that padding on the bottom so that it holds the moisture. And you can put it on its side, that's probably easier. Bring it up and wrap it around. If you need to adjust that bottom bit, do. Because you can see how that's gonna hold all that moisture. Stick it back in your pot and re-snap. Just stick those in. And you can hear it snap. Take it back around. Work your way through your plant. And let's hang, we'll hang these up. These go on my front porch, which is in the summer. We have eaves. I'll fiddle around with this. <laughs> there we go. And we're going to put this one back in its little slot right there. You can hear it snap. And the last one goes right here. There you go. So you're gonna water this in. The water will hold in the bottom of the diaper. And I found last year it didn't drip so much on my porch. So what a great tip. I would think for any hanging pot, these are the, probably the only two hanging pots, pots that I would put my diapers on that I would worry about the rest are in the garden. But try it, see if you like it. Uh, if, you know, if you have a neighbor across the street who has children, just go borrow a couple diapers and try it. But there you are. This my tip on how to keep your ferns from drying out. We'll see you the next time. Bye.